Hey everyone, it's the Taylorette here. Here I am disclosing my messy room. There is stuff all over the floor. And that over there, that pile, is all my scraps and leftovers. I just started my assembly line and I finished cutting out my saris for the dresses. However, I am short for lining, so I have to run to the store because today is cutting out linings. I am really tired because I was up till midnight last night cutting out these saris and I want to reach my goal. Once I get off track, that's when everything just goes downhill from there. So yeah, I'm off to the store right now. So yeah, I hid the camera and uh, I don't think anyone's coming, so. So I found what I'm looking for and I'm gonna have them cut and I'm gonna get out of here. And now it's time to cut it on in stacks. Here I have my size sixes and here I have my eight. If you're thinking that I stack six fabrics at the same time, that is correct. And if you multiply that by two because they're actually folded in half, there's actually 12 layers of fabric in here. Why I do that is because I like to cut everything at the same time. This is a part of assembly line is doing everything at the same time. However, I did only do six fabrics at a time because they're both two different sizes. I have my sixes and I have my eights. So I'm starting with my sixes first and then I'll do my eights. So while I have this extra space here, I figure I might as well pin some pattern pieces. So that is it for the sixes, and now I'm on to the eights, but I don't wanna bore you with that, so I'm gonna turn the camera off, so bye. And voila, the dresses are cut and ready to be sewn together, but before I do that, I think I might clean up my studio because I wanna be able to come back after lunchtime and have a completely clear mind. But FYI, my studio is not normally clean because I do have piles everywhere, and when I'm creating a dress, it is much more messy. And I put all of my sari scraps in here and I will save these. However, I don't save my lining fabrics because I don't need those. These are just so special. Now it's time to start sewing. All my piles are organized. I have the front pieces there and the back pieces there and then I'll separate the linings later after I'm done with those. But I'm gonna send them through the serger. Side seams are done, and there's my pile, and I need to let off some energy, so I'm gonna go for a run, and I will be right back. And I'm back, and I'm now stacking all the different layers in different piles so I can press them in order. So all the layers are in order. I have my linings, I have my mid layer, which is the long layer where the panel comes out at the bottom, and I have my over layer, which is the shorter layer. It's shorter so that the panel can come out in the bottom and you can see it. I'm about to press them, and then the next step will be to bring all the layers together so that each dress has three layers total. Okay, so here's the deal. I just finished hemming those and those. However, it's going to be a late night because I'm going to be working on finishing layering the dresses, but I will wrap this video up and there will be another sequel to this video coming out on Thursday. So hit the subscribe button and like this video if you enjoyed it. And thank the Lord for Twinkle Lights because it's going to be a late night and I will see you all Thursday.